So here's the dual action cylinder getting ready to test. Actually cleaned up quite a bit of the friction on the cylinder, so I'm testing this at a lower PSI. Getting that attachment on there proved to be a whole lot more work than I had hoped for. But everything works now. So, here's activation. And I'll switch the hose over to the retraction port. And there we go. Okay, so I actually have this cylinder working in both directions, and a little more interesting is it's now controlled. So basically, I have an Arduino Uno with a relay shield on it, and then that has supplemental pa power from a small 12-volt battery. And it's essentially cycling two of those relays, and that is activating the solenoid network each of which has, they're paired up so that one solenoid activates to allow air to go into the cylinder and the other one activates to release air from the cylinder when it's pushing the other way. And all together, it's working quite nicely. Okay, the limiting factor of the last test was the solenoid valves that I was using just really weren't designed for high pressure, so anything over about 20 PSI and they stopped functioning correctly. So I decided to drop a little bit of money and get a proper solenoid valve. So that's what this is here. This is a five-way two-position valve, and that allows for the exhaust and the, power, the air supply to work in the same valve with only one solenoid. And I still have all the electronics hooked up the same way. So, we give it a little bit of air here. And for maximum effect, let's get it up to about 60 PSI here. Now that's almost scary.